everybody. Welcome to Run With The Vision Sunday. This is the very, very first Sunday that we've ever done this, and I'm excited to be here and to be sharing this with you today. Uh, I'm going to share what God has laid on our heart to do as a church and where we're going in 2016. But before we do, I want to take a moment. I just want to pause and I want to reflect on everything we did in 2015. And I believe that as we do, that our faith will rise in us and it will help push us and propel us forward into what God has for us in 2016. So I'm going to take just a moment. I'm going to run through our calendar, put on your seatbelt, and get ready because we had an incredibly busy 2015. In January, we moved into our new facility in November of 2014. By January 2015, we had to move to two services to accommodate all the people that were coming to Simple Church. In February, we launched a brand new event partnering with the Lions Club of Reynoldsburg called Reynoldsburg's Got Talent. This was a massive talent show with 20 acts. We had 300 people show up and the whole thing was put together so that we could bring attention to and bring some funds to an organization called A Kid Again. A Kid Again helps families that have children with life-threatening illnesses be a kid again. And so what a great organization to partner with and support. And we were able to, to give them $1,800 at our first event. What a great time. In April, we partnered with the city to do breakfast with the bunny and to help out with the Easter festivities and the Easter egg hunt. In July, we always march in the parade. And this year, we did it again. We had the loudest and most decorated float in the parade. For the fireworks, this year was our biggest uh, opportunity ever because we had an even bigger presence at the fireworks. The city gave us prime location right in the middle of everything and said, do whatever you'd like to, be a blessing. And so we showed up, not only did we give away a thousand bottles of water, but we had uh, face painting, balloon animals, and a photo booth that people could stop by and get their photos taken. In August, we partnered with the Civic Park Friendly Basketball League. We've, this is our third time that we get together with them and we've played them in basketball. The last two times we've lost, but this year, this year we beat them. In addition to that, we were able to provide those kids of that program with 23 pairs of shoes. In September, as a church, we took a huge step of faith and ventured out into our very first missions trip. We went to El Salvador and our mission to go uh, was to take 300 bags of food and give them to 300 different families and homes and pray with them in hopes to lead them to Christ. Well, the result of that was over 50 different people said yes to Jesus on that trip. In October, we partnered with the city once again for their community Halloween party. What a great time it was, even though it got rained out after the first hour, a thousand people showed up and, and had an incredible time. Simple Church showed up in force. It was wonderful. October also gave us the opportunity. We launched our first youth group with 20 kids. And that youth group has continued to roll, roll uh, for the rest of the year with kids coming every week, experiencing God's love and turning their hearts to him. In December, we partnered with the city for two different events, Christmas on the Town and Breakfast with Santa, where we were able to provide activities and food and just a great time to bless the city. Throughout the year, we also had new opportunities to partner with different missions. Barefoot Faith is one. Barefoot Faith is based here in Reynoldsburg, but they serve the, the Columbus metro area. Families that, that need help or need uh, food, or have somebody in the hospital or are in need some way, Barefoot Faith shows up and says, let us bless you with food. Let us pray with you. They're being active and being the hands and feet of Jesus. Also, we picked up new missionaries, Don and Terry Triplett and Julio Martinez in El Salvador with monthly financial support for the work that they're doing there. In addition to that, we partnered with Souls for Souls. Simple Church alone contributed to 136 pairs of shoes. Overall, that particular drive where we partnered with other churches that were also collecting shoes, that one drive got 1,737 pairs of shoes. We also partnered financially with a new church plant called Summit Creek Church that launched in September uh, in Des Moines, Iowa. Since they launched and opened their doors the rest of the year, they've seen 85 people say yes to Jesus with already 181 people in attendance at that brand new work. In addition to these things, we already had missionaries that we supported on a regular basis 18 different mission works around the world from Panama, Thailand, El Salvador, Kenya, Somalia, Paris, the West Bank, 
Djibouti, even here in Ohio and Ethiopia and Iowa, the total amount that our church gave to works around the world was $13,875. Bringing that focus back home, we had an incredible year of God's grace and favor as we as a church saw 194 people say yes to Jesus. And that brings our grand total as a church to 321 since we opened our doors. What an incredible thing this is that God is doing among us. And I'm so thankful that I'm a part of this community of believers. And I can't wait to see what God is going to do with us in 2016.